Hi, it's January. Welcome to day number three of my Inky Countdown of 2024. Starting off with the Inkvent calendar. Where's day number three? Here we go. I can spot it straight off. A little bit off camera. Let's position this so it's on the camera. Just checking my preview. There we go. Day number three. Let's get on in. Wow, it looks like a nice green ink. Noble fur. Wow. And this, oh, it's a star bright. This is our first star bright. I really liked last year's star bright. So noble fur. Let's move that to one side. Take a look in again in a second. And with the colour verse, day number three is easy to find. It's right at the top corner. Again, let me make sure I get this onto the camera. Day number three. Moonlit Veil. Moonlit Veil is a colour inspired by the moment when the moonlight softly illuminates a dark night. So I'm guessing this is going to be a grey colour. There we go, Moonlit Veil. Pop that to one side and move this away. Let's fetch in the notepad of testing. 68 GSM Tomai River Paper, Endless Recorder Notebook, We'll start with Noble Fur. So because this is star bright, wow, just look at that in the green there. I wonder if it's a green star, star bright or still a silver. Well, we'll find out soon enough, won't we? Let's agitate this, or as I'm oft to say, irritate it. Get it all mixed up. Give it a good shake. Twirl it around a bit. Now we've still got some there. Doesn't want to go into suspension. Let's see if we can get right into that corner. Oh, there we go. Yes, there we go. That's all mixed up. My testing tool, my serendipity dip pen with a broad nib. Wow. So this is day three. Let me just scribble off a bit more. It seems to have a lot of ink on here. And this is diamine. Noble fur. Nice bright green colour. And the sentence. Just flows off the nib, this ink. All the inks so far have been really nice writers and I must have dipped in too far because I've got a nice green stain. I'll fetch in my card, hopefully without getting too much green on it. And I'm taking the whole thing over with me. I'm just moving that over. So this is ink vent. I have spelt it right. That's the first time I've spelt it right so far. And it's day three. And it's diamine. Just gonna re dip ever so gently. Noble fur. I wonder how much of that star bright will come out in this. Very pretty. Just clean off the nib, then we can look at the other ring. So let's move the card out to one side. Here's the other one. Moonlit Veil. Wow, this tight. <laughs> this cap feels it's on tight. So we'll do the same. Dip the ink in. Well, dip the pen in, really, not the ink. I scribble off a little bit of excess. And um, then we go. Day three. Moonlit Veil. Yeah, this looks like a really nice grey ink. Trying to avoid a finger that's not covered in green. My sentence. Just going to do another quick dip. Oh, going to go on to the next line. Then we'll fetch in the card. 
I'm just going to do another dip. And here we've got colour vent. Day number three. And it's, it's colour verse. Colour verse. Moonlit. Moonlit. Veil. Let's do that scribble. And then do a little swipe. So I'll pop it in the water to start cleaning. Let's move these to one side so they've got time to dry. Whilst they're drying, we'll fetch in the chocolate calendar. There we go. Day number three. Where's day number three? Oh, down near, near the bottom. Day number three. Hopefully, yep, we can get that in the camera preview. What picture have we got? Oh, we've got Santa's boot there. He's giving us the boot. Let's pop that chocolate out. Oh, we've got Frosty the snowman there. Snowman's head. Pop that to one side. Uh, that's my loving wife. Let's move this out of the way and fetch in the gift that she's bought me. So, here we've got the big bag. The big bag of presents. Wow. And let's see. Oh, a little bit smaller box today. A very light feeling. So here we go. We've got a, a lighter feeling box. She's put numbers on them to make it easy for herself when she's got to get them out. So day number three. Let's rip into this paper. Oh, awesome. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I like Star Trek. Um, I also like Lower Decks, which is an animated version of Star Trek. This is one of the main characters, Tendi. Oh, that's absolutely awesome. I do have a number of other pop vinyls, so this will then now go on the shelf with them. That's a, a growing collection I've got. This is superb. Really? Oh, this is awesome. Let me pop that to one side and we'll fetch in that notepad of testing again. So starting with the noble fur. Wow. I'm not sure how well the camera's picking this up. But once you hit this right with the light, it's just pure silver. That's all you can see. It's really nice. And then turn the light away and what you get, you get just plain green. And then occasionally you get a mix of the two. Very nice. This star bright looks really nice on this green color. So I'm hoping the camera's catching it. How about the card? How's it performed on the card? I would say not as pronounced star bright wise, but I'd re-dip the pen and chances are some of that star bright had already dropped down to the bottom. So that would explain that. With the colour verse, yeah, as as I thought, this is a really nice grey. Looks really nice. It's another one I think I've got to get into a pen, either a broad or a stub pen, I would think, with this one. This would have looked nice if there was a bit of like shimmer in it, you know, that silver shimmer or that star bright, I think would have really looked quite nice in that. I know colour verse don't do star bright. And then in the card, again, beautiful, nice grey there. So that was day number three of my Inky Countdown. What do you think of today's inks? How do you think they're going? I really I love that green, I will be honest. I think that could end up being in my top inks. Really enjoying them, really nice. Love to have your comments down below. Please hit the thumbs up button every time you like. Every time you comment just helps with the YouTube algorithm. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so that you can get new videos as I release them. I'll talk to you again soon.